You're on cross-country racing, rally road racing. You just can't stay away, can you? No, I tried my best, Colin. After last year, I actually decided I'm going to sell this car and um, concentrate on a few other things. But as you know, the, the season's really starting very late this year. Mm. And it just gave me too much time to think about it. <laughs> the thing is that if you get rid of a car now, there's a queue for cars, it, you know, from any of the manufacturers in South Africa. So once you've got a toy, you've got to keep your toy. Yeah, that, that was part of the decision. And um, like you said, you won't get a car for the next two years. Mm. But you've shaken it up quite nicely because we see Falcon tires, Expel, of course, Eau de Cure, no smell and all of that. What's the story with the Falcon tires um, taking on the cross-country series? Okay, so I had a call from Hindset ATS. They one of the distributors for Falcon Tires. They want to get an in into the nationals with a, a, a more affordable, good tire. And as you remember, we tested it last year, Marion Dahl. Mm. It's a it, we we threw everything that we had at it. It is a very good tire. And so they asked me if I could get get on board and run Falcons at the nationals for the year. So that's what we're going to do. We got Falcon uh, on board. We'll um, we've got Expel. Mm -hmm. as, as a port sponsor, Row Oils, mm -hmm. they're on board with us. And oh, they're proper oils. They won a Burgling 24 with a BMW about two years ago, didn't they? Yes, it's, it's, they, yeah, it's brand new in South Africa, but it's a very, very well-known, proven lubricant. It's, it's very, very good. Completely different track that you're taking. I love that. Are you going to use, um, you're going to run in the regional um, cross countries as well? We, we missed a few because of the, yeah, the, the car was being rebuilt for, for this year. So we'll definitely run a, f a, few, mm. a few regionals later on in this year. Because there's a great guess at the regionals. Yeah, I love doing the regionals. And um, yeah, me and Gerard will probably do a few, few regionals later in the year. And on the nationals, I've got a new navigator, uh, Adrian Roots, yeah. also a very experienced mm. youngster. Um, I think he's won two national championships. And um, yeah, really looking forward to having some new energy on the board. Now we go into first race is uh, uh, shortly coming up. Yeah, it's next weekend in Malalon. Yeah, Malalon Toyota, um, they're putting a, a big effort into it. It's always great to go down the lovely Gesellig area there. Yeah, Team Hilux, um, they've really stepped up this time, sponsoring the event and um, yeah, very grateful to them. It's a, it's a lovely area to go cross-country racing in. Yeah, I think there's, there's less harsh areas to, 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 <laughs> to race in. But um, yeah, it's a good, good opener for the season. It served us very well last year. So hopefully we can do what we did. And in your class, T1, what are the, um, who you, where's the race going to be? Yeah, Eben Basson is there still. I mean, he's extremely Brilliant. fast. Um, Nicholas Pinar is also racing with us again in a Revo. Heinlein brothers. Uh, the Heinlein brothers are there. They are getting faster and faster every race that they're out there. And um, yeah, Johan van Staden is there. He's got a brand new Ford engine Gen 3 motor in his in his duster. So he's going to be a force to be reckoned with. And That's um, still one of the nicest sounding motors in the cross country racing. Yeah, it's a, I didn't want that because it's a high revving engine. But mm. yeah, it's, they make a lot of power. It's a good engine. Well, new car rebuilt. You got it back from Terence. Sorry for who was going to buy it, but um, that's that's life. And now you go and take a what looks like a brand new car and run it through the bush at Malalan. It's yeah. going to look like this at the end. No, it'll look good. Um, like I said, we've got Expel on board. They're going to wrap the whole car over the, the vinyls and um, we'll prove their products that, that it actually works. We'll take some before and after pictures. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it breaks my heart. Eh? Coming from a track background, and it's actually so tough for me the first few miles. You know how you, what you throw at these cars, and yeah. but also how they can handle it. I mean, these redline amazingly tough. Eh? Yeah, these yeah. redline revos. Well, all the redline cars are extremely good. I mean, the well built. It's beautiful inside. It's it's just such a work of art. Johan, take Rex. Is it still called Rex? Yeah, it's definitely Rex, and it'll it'll look very different when you see it next time. Well, I hope so. Take Rex, give it horns, have some fun and good luck for National Rally Road Championship. Thanks a lot, Colin. Thanks for chatting to us. Cheers.